a five-month-old girl has bilateral retinoblastoma. Neither parent has a history of having had this cancer. Chromosomal analysis of the patient's stimulated peripheral blood lymphocytes is done. The photograph is of a representative karyotype. Which of the following critical events has most likely resulted from an aberration involving chromosome 13? The correct answer is tumor suppressor gene loss. Karyotype shows loss of a part of 13th chromosome. RB gene is located in chromosome 13Q. It is a tumor suppressor gene. Both copies of RB gene must be lost or inactivated for retinoblastoma to develop. Two hit hypothesis. One copy of RB gene was lost due to loss of a part of 13th chromosome. Some mutation may have inactivated the remaining copy. This is the reason for bilateral retinoblastoma in the child. Retinoblastoma is a cancer of the eye and specifically a cancer of the retina in very young children. It is a rare cancer. In the United States it's estimated that there are about 275 cases a year. So it's somewhere between the fourth and the seventh most common cancer of childhood in the United States. On the other hand, these children are very young. It represents about a third of all the children diagnosed with cancer in the first month of age. And I have diagnosed and treated children with cancer before their due date, but after they were born, that is, they were premature. So it can develop very, very early in children. Worldwide, there are somewhere between five and 8,000 cases a year in the world. And the incidence appears to be the exact same in every country, in every ethnic group, in every economic group. It's a mutation that occurs in cells. It's the first cancer that uh, the genetics were figured out in 1986, despite the fact that it's a very rare cancer.